Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Deshwin. Most people call me Des, feel free to call me whichever. I'm so excited to be making this video. I feel like it's been forever because it honestly has. It's been over a week since I last posted and I'm sure you guys know if you follow me on Instagram or any of my social media, what's been going on or if you have social media, you know what's been going on within our world and it's just, it's really nuts and it's just been really hard for me to concentrate and focus on creating content so i really just wanted to take time to myself and just take a break from you know creating and kind of being on social media so yeah i don't want you guys to think that that's going to be normal me not posting that often because it honestly does not feel right not posting that often i missed y'all some of y'all have been asking me for a new video so here it is also before i start Big thank you to all of you guys because I reached 4K, yay, I'm so excited. It's like, I understand, you know, 4,000 subscribers is not a lot compared to many other YouTube channels, but my channel has been growing so much so fast, you know, with the help of you guys. So I'm just so grateful and so appreciative for all of you, all of your support, all of the love. It just makes me feel so good. So thank you guys and let's get into this video so today actually makes two months that i started this set of locks i know my hair is looking like who gone done it and why but i'm gonna moisturize it for you guys so you can see up close and personal the progress the growth it's just beautiful if you haven't watched my moisturize routine and how i moisturize my locks go do that i'm gonna put it up there one of these corners it's gonna be there for you to watch so go do that and then come back to this video okay so now that my hair is nice and moisturized let's get into this update so the biggest thing that i've noticed that has changed with my hair is the budding and the frizz which of course is expected anyways but it's happening a lot faster than my very first set of locks at like an alarming rate even before i hit the two month mark some of them were budding like crazy and i'm gonna show you what i mean this bad boy is probably one of the few that is really just moving along quickly this one too they are my thicker ones so i'm not really surprised what's really annoying one thing I don't like, which I know I'm just gonna have to deal with anyways, but how it's like budding at the root and then it just still looks like a twist the rest of the way down. It's like, can we do something else, please? Like, I stop. It's annoying. I just want it to all look, I want them to all look like locks. And only some of them are looking like locks right now. I'm being impatient, I know. And as you can see, the frizz is definitely there. I also rinsed my hair the other day. I didn't wash it, I just rinsed it. I'm hoping that I can wait until I retwist my hair to wash it. Yeah, this one is crazy, the budding. And it feels like very dense too already. That's what a lot of them feel like. They feel very dense. Um, you know, there's things that go on with my hair that you can't really see. I feel my hair every day, so it's not like you guys are able to feel my hair and to really feel the changes. You guys can only see the changes, but I feel it every day. Like, I feel another one that's becoming more dense, or I feel them starting to knot up more. I've been getting a lot of the knots at the ends. So I found one of the knots at the ends. As you can see, I know my nails are long, guys, but um, as you can see, it's not coming out easily. I'm not really tugging on it either because I don't want it to come out. Some of them are small, some of them are big. Sometimes I'll play with them, yes. The only time they come off is if it's already just like hanging really low. Or if I'm like putting my hair into a ponytail, I'm like going like this with my hair sometimes, some of them will come out. But other than that, I don't intentionally pull them off. Try not to do that if you are experiencing those little knots. 
they do help your hair seal in my experience so i would just let them rock because they're not causing any harm so leave it alone and also too as you guys can see like my hair hasn't really been shrinking up a lot then again i do do a lot of styles because of work or it's just been really hot so i will put my hair up in a ponytail or i'll just do different kind of styles which I am going to make another video because you guys have been asking me for more styles. So I will be making a video soon about that. But when even when I stretch out my hair or if I'm wearing a style that will stretch it out, I do moisturize my hair afterwards so it kind of snaps back. But with this set, with the two strand twist, I have not been experiencing a ton of shrinkage. I'm expecting it at some point. I know it's going to come. It's just going to like hit me one day and I'll be like, oh okay but as for right now it hasn't really been too crazy I'm, i haven't really been able to wear my hair out like this a whole lot because of work so it's pretty annoying because i do like wearing my hair out even though it doesn't always look how i would like it to but you know you just have to understand that it's just a part of the process of your hair looking like what the f but <laughs> You know, you gotta go through it. So I'm just trying to be patient with my hair and not rush it and not, you know, think too much about it and just letting time go by because these two months have honestly gone by so, 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 so very fast. Another thing that I've noticed too with the two strand twist is that I'll get pieces like that are kind of going outwards like that compared to the comb coils where it just would get fat it's like part of the two strand twist is like budding outwards i'm gonna show you what i mean because that kind of sounds confusing so let me see if i can find one where i notice it a lot i think it's this one that's budding like crazy okay can you guys see that y'all can see that how it's like going inwards and then outwards some of them have been doing that, which I'm excited about because that just shows me that my hair is coming along, it's progressing, so I'm not mad at it, even though it looks kind of crazy. I'm not mad, it's part of the process. Oh wow. Nothing too, too major has happened other than the frizz and the budding. Yes, they do like to stick to each other sometimes and I do pull them apart daily, but that's expected. I haven't really been noticing a lot of marrying at my roots because like I said, I do pull them apart and I don't like when they start to do that because it hurts and I'm very tender-headed, as most of you guys probably know this already. So yeah, I just try to really get into a good habit of making sure that they're not sticking together. And I pull them apart very gently because you don't wanna damage your hair, you don't wanna snap your hair, that's just gonna cause issues later down the road. Now that I pretty much covered everything, which wasn't really much, I'm gonna give you guys an up close look at my hair because I know before I started my locks, I really just wanted to get an up close look of people's starter locks just to see you know, what you can expect, what they look like just a few months in. So I'm gonna do that for you guys because someone out there might wanna see that because I did. So I'm gonna show you guys what my hair is looking like.
so yeah that's pretty much it for this update guys i hope you enjoyed this video also someone did request a lock q a so i definitely want to do that video because you guys ask me questions every single day not complaining i love it and i'm super happy that you guys trust me with your hair questions and it's lit like y'all want to come to me y'all want my advice like i'd be super gassed so keep coming in with the questions i'm gonna try my best to answer you guys as fast as i can but i do want to do an actual video of a lot q a so if you have questions it doesn't matter how many you can either dm me on instagram you can comment on any of my stuff you can comment under this video just however you want to reach out to me you can reach out to me i'm also going to be including like a business email pretty soon so you guys can reach out to me that way i don't know if it's going to be up and running for this video but for future videos it definitely will be so yeah keep an eye out for that okay there was a car alarm going off so i'm not really sure where i left off but if you guys have any questions you guys know how to reach out to me i always drop all my social media below in the description so feel free to dm me to come under this video to reach out to me however you want to it doesn't really matter i'm gonna see it likely one way or another so that's it for this video guys thank you so 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 much for watching and i'll see you guys next time